Hi, Moondog here, and I want to talk about something that I noticed while watching other PewTubers on YouTube. And that is when they review optics like this one that I'm reviewing this week, they seldom ever actually show you the reticle, the, the red dot in the red dot. And that's because when they do, it ends up looking horrible. Here, I'll show you what I'm talking about, uh, if I can get the camera to focus in on uh, the optic itself. And that's really the crux of the problem, is the camera's ability, or lack thereof, to focus. Now here we are, nice and sharp, the uh, red dot looks great. Um, but once you actually look at the red dot, what do you see? A big, fat red blob. Not something that's precision. This does not look like a precision optic at, by any stretch. But really, looks can be deceiving. Here we see this same optic, but now the reticle is nice and sharp. And that's because the camera is not focused in at um, the optic, but focused at uh, objects that are 50 to 100 yards away. And that's the typical range that we're shooting targets at, at, at a range, um, you know, 25, 50, 100 yards. Now compare that to this view. This is the same exact optic, the same reticle, but now the reticle looks big, blobby, freaking huge, because that's just the limitations of the camera, of our camera and YouTube. So the next time you see an optic on YouTube, just take it with a grain of salt. Um, you, you may not be seeing what you'd actually be seeing with your, with your naked eyes. And that's just uh, the limitations of, um, of lenses and technology. Anyway, I hope this video was helpful and informative. And if you enjoyed watching it, please hit the like button. And if you're new to the channel, please hit subscribe. You be safe out there. Moondog out.